Hey guys, it's me, Caitlin. So I took a short break, but I'm back. Um, if you read the thing below, this review is on So Sweet Stitches by Ashley. I've been actually um, ready to do this review, but I haven't. <laughs> um, sorry. So this seller is a Facebook and Etsy seller. Uh, she sent me these pads to review um, and I will tell you how I think of them. So um, how I actually got these, which she did send them to me, she messaged me on Facebook and asked, her, asked me if I would review and I said of course, of course I will. I have some openings this um, month and I'll give them a try and I'll let you know how I feel. Um, which I did. Um, but I've actually seen Ashley's pads before, uh, through cloth pad buy, buy, sell, and trade, through, uh, through, uh, pad auctions, uh, yeah. I've actually been wanting to try them and wanting to buy some, but, um, Life happens sometimes, and I haven't got around to it. So, these are awesome, and I'll show you what I got. Um, I'll start off with this liner she sent me. It's a 7-inch liner, and it's knit top. I actually started my period with this guy, and I didn't get to wear him as long as I wanted to, but um, I wore it long enough to know that it worked really well for me. Um, the shape in general is good. Um... 7 inches. I really like 7 inches, but I'm leaning more towards 8 inches now. Um, 7 inches is when I'm wearing like more of my narrow underwear. So, this worked really well. Um, what it has in the middle is door, but one layer I'm guessing. Um, and it has the Wind Pro gray back, which is really nice. It's so soft. Um, snaps up really well and I'll show you that in a second when I get it snapped oh my goodness so there's that looks great it's very thin not one of the thinnest ones I have but it works really well um but yes I like kind of uh thicker liners I guess maybe because they stay in place um just depends what I'm wearing though so, the next one she sent me is this nice 10 inch regular, or moderate, What I guess it depends what you call it. This is a cotton top, it's like cotton woven, um, yeah. It also has the Pro, Win Pro back, it's got Zorb and, I'm guessing one layer of Zorb and one layer of heavy organic bamboo fleece, um, but I think that makes it very thin also because this is a very thin pad. For moderate, that's really thin. Mm -hmm. um, again, this is almost as thin as the liner, to be honest. But again, I washed this. It looks really nice. Um, no pilling, no uh, stains. The snaps are in good shape. Um, yeah, it's a good pad. Um... This wasn't my favorite though, um, not because of, not because of the shape or anything, but I'll show you my favorite. I think it's because it's a little bit thicker, um, but here it is. This is my favorite. I did have a little bit of trouble with staining, um, but I just did one straight stain treatment, which is, um, I just sprayed an extra thing of OxyClean on and washed it again, and, um, it worked really well. It just came right out. Um, this is, this is a knit top. It has a lot of stuff in the middle, actually. Um, I have it written down because there's quite a bit. It's, uh, heavy organic bamboo fleece, micro fleece, terry, and charcoal bamboo. Um, that's a lot of stuff. <laughs> so, and, but, it, I mean, for a heavy, that, I mean, it's pretty thick. This is a more, I guess, structured pad, and I like that about it, so, um, that works for me. I really like the wings also. It snaps up pretty good. Yeah, it's good. Um, again, this is really nice. It has a Wimpro fleece back. 
Yeah, win pro. Win pro, please. So soft. I like it. Um, yeah. There's a pet. I think there's actually still a stain down here a little bit. You guys probably can't see it. But I must have forgot that part. That's okay. It looks really good. One thing I gotta say about Ashley's pads is her uh, stitching around the core center of the pad. It's very neat. Um, that's one way I can tell her pads, uh, like from the other makers, and I like that. Um, keep doing that, Ashley. It's really nice. Um, anytime that you have something of your um, kind of your technique, it's very nice to have because then I can spot it out. Um, not only just me, but like other makers um, or other people buying your pads, and that's something good. Um, so, on to the big one that she sent me. I was a little disappointed with this, and um, I know it's free, and I can't complain, but you sent it to me to review. Um, and it's just that the core is sewn on a little crooked. That being said, if it wasn't core, I probably would have liked this pad. Um, it's a little wide for me. Um, but if the core was sewn on straight, see how that's... I bled exactly where it was sewn off to, which is, I sew, or I appear, I was like, here. But, nice thing about this baby is it has a hidden layer of PUL, so I didn't leak. Um, this would make an extremely nice nighttime pad. It's a pink. The light's kind of dimming it out. Um, it's a very, the top is a wicking, a wicking fabric. I don't remember what it's called. Um. Even if I knew what it was called, I can't pronounce it anyways. But, yeah. Um, this top is a heavy also, or this pad is a heavy also, which means it has <clears throat> the heavy organic bamboo fleece, the micro fleece terry, the charcoal bamboo fleece, um, all in the middle. Um, it has cotton woven backing, or it's just cotton, I believe. Cotton woven. But, um... The wings worked really well for me. I think all that I have to say is that if it was sewn on a little bit, um, it would have worked perfectly. <clears throat> it is a little wide, like I said, but um, for some women, they like wide pads. And I this works really well for, well, I have scrundies and the guts or the underwear is a little bit, um, I guess, wider in the crotch. Um, and that worked really well with this. It is pretty thin, I do have to say, for being a heavy. It's like, this feels kind of like a moderate to me. Look how thin that is. Um, but it did absorb really well for where I did bleed at. So it did its job, and that's all I asked for it to do. <laughs> yeah. So that was really nice. Um, one thing she did send me that I wasn't really used to having being sent and I actually really liked it. So, um, I don't even know if I'm using it the correct way, but it works. So, I'm just going to tell you how I used it. This is an 8x8 Sherpa. I believe that's how it is pronounced. Um, cloth white. This is a cotton woven top, which is very cute. Good choice, Ashley. Your fabrics are very nice, um, colorful, and you have a quite good variety. She has um, flowers to, I believe she has food to, I, I've seen mermaids, which is super cool, um, to kind of like geom geometric shapes, which is awesome too. I like that. Um, so this works really well. Um, Sherpa, I believe, is absorbent itself, but um, I don't necessarily use it for down there. Um, I have used it on my son though and he likes it. He grabs it and like wants to play with it because it's so soft. But the way, the way I use it is I actually clean off my glasses with it. Um, it works perfectly on my desk which is where I'm at now. And uh, I can't always go out to the kitchen to go get a wipe sometimes. So um, I really like it for that. Um, I've used it on my son, like I said, and it works really well. 
Um, I get it wet and then use it, so. So, um, how you get a hold or get some pads is she does ready to sell, but those sell very quickly from what I've heard. Um, actually what I've seen too, she also does customs. Um, like I said, she has an Etsy store and a Facebook. Facebook is mostly for customs, I'm guessing, but you could probably message her on Etsy. Um, I will link both of those below so you can kind of check it out. Look what she's got. Um, uh, she doesn't have a wait list from what I... No wait list, which is good. Um, yeah. So if you want to check out them, um, definitely recommend checking out some of these. Especially this. I love this. I'm thinking about ordering another if you don't. So, um... And the pads worked really well. They held up from what they wanted or from what I used them for. I used the heavies on the heaviest days. And I used the lighter or moderates on my lighter days. And they held up really well. Um, washing them more than once, they've held up, um, which is what I love. So go check them out. I'll link those below, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye, guys.